Hi guys, in this one we are back to El Clasico. We will be cloning yet again PancakeSwap. PancakeSwap is a decentralized exchange on the Binance Smart Chain. Um, so, you know, you go there, you buy crypto. Let's check, actually, let's check, uh, connect wallet and check this out a little bit. Again, guys, please know Haku. Okay, get that one time for the... Um, cool points all right so you uh, you go you uh, uh they realized like um it wasn't uh, let's do a quick switch here so you can see what's up all right so you that was a uh, perfect all right so you go here uh, pancakes up we all kind of know it love it um decentralized exchange all right um now they've added like a bunch of features but the um the primary focus of of this uh, uh project is uh, to have an exchange where you can go buy and trade different crypto tokens right so you can swap ethereum for cake which is pancake swap native token show the pancake swap and the pancake swap team they've done an awesome job of maintaining this project throughout the years um so show them all right and um yeah so you get the idea you go you buy you sell tokens um uh, i think uh, newly they've updated to like v3 um v2 still quite popular v2 is what we um we uh closed last time or i think they were just transitioning to v3 um but they've also added like a bunch of features you know and guys you know i'm not super familiar with like everything that's like going on in in, in pancake swap right now so like i you know I, um a lot of these features are new to me so you'll be um coming right along as i go through the, the journey the process of figuring all these stuff oh, all this stuff oh you see all my mistakes all uh, i'm sure there'll be lots of things that cause uh, cause me pain you know we'll go ahead and we'll set up servers to host our site and um yeah we'll just get our own uh version of punk uh, pancakes up going you know servers setting up domain name all this the, the jazz will bring back good old pixel swap all right i'm sure there'll be much much pain much pain you have to go through hopefully these videos will help but if you do want something like this done i'll leave my email and my links down below actually just email you guys mostly hit me up with email hit me up via email um get in touch with my agency and me and my guys will get it all set for you all right or any other um you know non pancakes up uh web project all right uh web three project all right so um ads aside you know let's kind of scroll what's uh you know see what's going on and pancakes up these days yeah see they added uh, nice graphics more nice graphics you know more nice graphics you know kind of just giving you the intro on this first page very nice very tasty looking pancakes there gotta have that um they added you know support for other a lot of other chains so by last time when we uh cloned this uh, maybe not exactly last time but the most popular one you guys know what i'm talking about they only had um uh bnb you know i see they have ethereum polygon base all right so love to see that um again show the pancake swap team bridge all right so that's swap you know um bridge they also added perps but i i think this is hosted somewhere else so it's more or less kind of like a different feature maybe we'll go ahead uh, and try and get something like this done if we have more time going in the series but um i'm trying to keep this one you know not too long guys so we're just kind of checking out the features and then we'll go ahead um you know um with uh getting 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 started right and again i'm trying to take this as uh step by step as can possibly actually i won't have a choice since i don't i'm not super familiar with all um the code base right now but um farms like always uh you know pancakes are having farms where you can go and you can um essentially you can put in your own tokens i'm avoiding all crypto jargon here i know it's called staking guys jesus christ all right and we can go and you can put in your own tokens um and in exchange they'll give you back some different tokens and then when you're done you can get back your own token so kind of like you know investing in like a bond or something like that or um a savings app not a savings account but some fund you know where you get stuff back like a partner i guess is is, is I don't know, that's a terrible analogy a bond okay guys all right a farm uh, well it's literally called a farm you're, you're buying chickens guys okay um so you buy your chickens here and they give you back different eggs i i.e tokens um uh quite popular 
Um, we had that last time as well. They also have uh, key up, switch back to BNB chain here since there's most of the features. Kiek staking, which is just, you know, um, farms, but, you know, with Kiek, which um, uh, typically gets paid out on Pancake, again, your native token. Um, I see they also added a ton of other stuff here. All right. Um, they also added like a bunch of pools. Uh, uh, pools. Uh, similar thing to. Right. Uh, pools where you put in cake and you earn some totally different token. Um, <coughs> Or you put in cake, you put in cake and you earn some different token. So it's also the difference between cake staking. You you you, you stay cake, you earn more cake. Alright, that's clear. Um pools. Ah, you stay cake, you earn a different token. Alright, so that's kinda the difference between um cakes and pools. What's position manager? I guess this is kind of like a manager for all your different farms and uh, stuff that you are in makes sense with a different kind that like with automated liquidity optimization what does that mean all right um we're kind of just checking it out um oh v3 once i saw the v3 i knew v3 i think has some uh, other uh that v3 in reference to uniswap v3 um which is the backbone of pancake swap and many other projects all right in reference to um I think V3 has features where you can um, stay, uh, uh, stake, uh, stake at different um, price levels. So that's kind of just explaining that. I'm sure we'll find out more about it later. All right, liquid staking. I think this is where you, um, I think this is where you can withdraw your stuff anytime or something like that. All right. Um, like a simple just normal normal uh, one-sided staking so they added that uh, whereas before you had to lock in kind of like lps to two tokens right so um just a ton of features being added added um by the guys here again show the pancakes of team let's also check out the game marketplace um this kind of like a different site which um it's kind of like an external thing, I guess, which is more closer to like um, casino type games ish. Oh God, did I just click this? My computer is too shitty to handle like even the most basic graphics right now. I like totally ditch my graphics card. Um, okay, I guess. Got that. Okay, so Web3 games. All right, love to see that too. Shout out my NFT warriors, doing very, very, very bad, but you know, we bounce back. Um, prediction, we know this already. We already um, uh, clone predictions. If you didn't see that video yet, go check out that video somewhere on the channel. Um, lottery, we already know this, but lottery pretty self explanatory. You, you put in some, you buy some tickets. If you win, you win. All right. Um, pottery, what the heck is pottery? Okay, indefinitely halted, so we kind of don't care, but um, still care. Okay, just like a ton of uh, stuff here. Uh, uh, okay. Uh, deposit cake on the monthly subscription day, first Monday of each month, your chance of winning depends on how many cake you deposit. Sounds similar to the lottery. So, what's the difference between lottery and pottery? Okay, maybe it's just cake. Um, if for this one, sounds sounds about right. Um, anyways, this continued, and of course we have the NFT uh, marketplace. This video um, um, indefinitely delayed. Um, if you guys do want to see the NFT marketplace, leave a comment down below. Um, I um, yeah, if there is enough uh, people asking for it, I will eventually get to it. Um, you know, but just a click around, you have your collections, you can buy your NFTs, you know, pretty straightforward, you just buy NFTs, um, you know, um, not 
nothing to uh, fancy to explain there. All right, but the point being, they have added a ton of features. All right, um, you know, since our um, a very popular um, you know series. All right, so we have a ton of things to look to look forward to. All right, and um, I'm sure there have been lots of changes in the code base as well. Um, actually, I'm I, I keep saying I'm trying not to make this video too long, and I like. Um, anyways ton of features so i'm sure there'll be lots to go pick pick about also in the code base again which i'm also not um uh pancake swap github um which was already you know fairly complicated so i'm sure it, it only has gotten um, better let's uh do we hit light mode do i do you guys like that or what um Oh no, this squared has its own. This squared. Anyways, um, GitHub. All right, so I'm um, sure there have been lots of um, changes there as well. Let me just check out um, some of the, the most um, relevant ones. And we'll get into how, you know, so these guys you know actively maintain the code base again good shut up and kick up um all right so lots and lots and lots of features to cover we will be covering it covering them um hopefully most if not all in this future but for sure we will be getting our own version of pancakes up up and running um setting up servers um covering all the, the just very basic and again guys i'm keep trying to keep this as simple as possible um so you guys can explain but you know that's your 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 intro right there pancakes of decentralized exchange you come here you are um, using your metamask which is just a browser extension right that allows you to buy and sell uh crypto you can see my bnb uh poverty there are no hacks guys um you know but um you connect your you connect your wallet i keep missing <laughs> I give us a I I I'm eventually going to get like hacked on here. Let me go here. Alright. Um all right, perfect. No, like that means shit hackers. But anyways, um yeah, so you go here, you connect your wallet, alright, and it allows you to trade tokens and all the cool stuff that these guys have added. Alright, so um we'll be cloning pancakes up, that's what we're doing and um so all right let, let, let's begin guys all right so you know like i said like i said in my original video um pancake swap is as you can see um actually open source so you can go online and find the code in this case you can go to github um github.com slash pancake swap whatever whatever and find the code and we can set it up all right and so um you know uh we should be a bit faster this time with the front with the front end the first thing you want to do all right, um, you wanna hit up GitHub, you wanna go to Pancakes of GitHub, I just Googled it and found like the first link. All right, um, uh, very, very important here, guys, this cause you guys have a lot of problems. Um, last time you wanna find the master branch. All right, um, make sure you're like on that. So you guys actively um, uh, do a lot. Um, oh, actually, this is so long ago, I wonder if we really do wanna get the develop but um uh, hmm. all right i'm gonna if it gives you guys problems like go with the, the go with the um the master i actually don't think it matters that much but go with the master branch but i'm gonna go with the develop just because we always want to be new but again these guys actively constantly um or working on this thing so you want to make sure um you get the, uh, the 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 either the master and if you know what you're doing you can get the develop all right i get the develop because uh, i want i think it's pretty old and you know um get the ma okay i you know let me let me um let me not be complicated we get the master branch guys all right we're making this simple 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 so Oh, is this this big? All right, so um, 
actually let me cancel this so you go step one go to uh, uh google pancake swap github all right you go to github all right you go and click front end should be pinned here or usually it's the first one here all right uh you want then you want to select master or you can type it in all right then you want to click uh, code then you want to click download all right and that will start or download there which i guess is taking um uh quite some time actually let me i wanna okay i wanna make sure i don't know why it's saying like six or taking this long this was way better before they should like sure Just show it like how much it's left. I swear, some of the, the updates that Chrome those buffers like my mind. Like, why would I care about like not seeing how much is left? Anyways, that is odd. I can't wrap my head around this one, Groom. Anyways, while that's downloading, I guess we'll, we'll see when the spinner is done spinning. All right. Um, yeah, like I said, guys. Um, you know, we've been we've been uh, doing a lot of um, stuff on the channel, guys. I promise more videos will come more regularly um but uh maybe i should uh, even do a a second channel for uh oh god i'm gonna I'm be real I, i'm like not in the mood for this thing to take this long right now jesus christ all right but in the meantime all right let me show you show you guys some other things that you might need um in case you don't have them so pancake soft is running um, it's developed um, with um, React and uh, Node.js, so we're gonna need some um, and TypeScript. All right, so we are gonna need some additional tools while we have that downloading. I already have them on my computer. I haven't updated them, so maybe it won't run. But either case, I'm bringing you guys right along, and I'll just show you the, those additional things you might need just in case. Perfect timing. All right, so one of the things you'll need is obviously Node.js. So you can just get that by doing Node.js download. All right you want to select the version that is right for your computer right so if you have windows you just go windows and it will start to save right and then you just download install it click everything yes and you should be fine all right the next thing you're going to want is typescript uh, install um, uh, actually i'm going to get Actually, let me do this first. The next thing you're gonna wanna get is yarn. So you're gonna do yarn install. Just type yarn install in um in the uh, the, uh, the browser, right? Now, once you have NP npm install, right? You should be able to, um, you can type, you can just type npm um, in the command prompt, right? Or you can, um, which is a method I'll be showing you guys, you can, downloads you can extract this here uh, move this here you can go extract extract it in a folder oh god i was not prepared for these times but anyway back to our downloads all right um so once you have um, npm installed you should be able to go to the command line uh, in any uh, folder or um, on your um, desktop and you should be able to click open terminal all right you can also let me do this in a folder actually you can also click right click i'm holding shift right click and then you can click open terminal all right um and that will open up a terminal which if you have installed npm correctly or node.js um, you should be able to do uh, npm-v, all right, and you should see be able to see your no, your N node 
npm version right that means you install it correctly now once you've done that you you're gonna want to install yarn all right so you're just like i said before you google yarn uh install in google you click copy i already have it installed so i don't know if it's gonna install maybe it wants to be updated um let me just go ahead and do that right now um so i already had it so it installed if, if for you it might take a bit longer um you can see um new major version of npm available see it's even uh, let me get even the new version of npm just to make sure i'm running the same version as you guys uh, yeah Do I want to? I really don't want to. Guys, when you download um node, all right, it will um install, it will add all those things for you. It wants me to update mine right now. I don't want to update. Um it should be it should be fine. Um actually. Um where me node install let me do it for the culture why not guys my keyboard is also um, got water damage so if you see random typing you know that's also Windows installer all right luckily this didn't take 10 years Since you're installing Node.js, um, that location is fine by me. Um, again, just click next. Uh, I'm also gonna uh, check uh, check yesterday's thing. All right, um, install. Just give you everything you want. I think that should also update my npm. Is the reason why I did that. All right, how are we looking on time? Too long. All right. Um, ah, and this thing we should pop up when you're done. Press any key to continue. I'm going to click any key. Um, any key. All right, this should be installing uh, NPM stuff. Yes. Yeah, typically don't want to be just clicking yes to everything on your computer, but this is fine. Um, Node.js is extremely popular. You have py Python, blah, blah, blah. Python blah 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 installing Python nice so all this you should see guys when you um, download Node.js for the first time if you already had Node.js installed then you probably don't have to go through this I just um, did it for um, the sake of um, uh, being you know uh, with these tutorials Python has been installed, environment variables changed, installing some other stuff, installing some other stuff, green, we like green. Good, good. So funny, like, what if you don't need any of this? And like, cause I'm a like, I'm working with off based off of like what was the other time. I know you need no JS, so I mean, but it'll be fun. I'm just kidding, guys. You need to um, install no JS, you know. So. Come on, PC. 
you go fast go faster a b d e go faster tubs in order so you guys can kind of see like the order which you're like installing things all right per perfect all right just for reference the previous videos as well being a lot of um you know waiting thankfully um to uh, the magic of youtube um you guys will be able to see forward but um yeah i do remember the build tools taking like forever you know in the meantime let us check or um optimistic always disappointed about hold on these things stable well, where was i all right so yeah um mm. i'm literally not gonna change screens just to keep it to you boys as solid so like you can just see in the like preview of the video like where exactly to fall, fast forward to so when you stop seeing this like blue screen it means something has happened okay all right now i fucked up but i couldn't help it it's taking too long um taking so long Jeez. finally Christ um, all right so it looks like uh, we have uh, finished everything type enter to exit enter does it really want me to type actual enter no yeah um, all right it's done all right my keyboard is like being a jackass but you know you guys hit enter i can just click x because i know it's done all right um so that should have npm uh install and you should have uh terminals like this when you type npm in the command prompt or alternatively with um what i'm gonna do which i'm gonna give you guys go in uh get into right now you can um hold shift and right click and open a terminal and then you can do um you should have npm like i said actually let's check this to see if it updated hmm. yeah, i'm very suspicious okay it doesn't matter it's installed all right so uh, the next thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to install yarn um once you have npm like i said guys i already have all these installed i'm just doing uh this for the sake of being um you know um you know uh thorough and to be honest because i assumed that all this would just do exactly what that did and told me i already had it installed 
All right, next you're gonna wanna have types uh, TypeScript. All right, um, looking for the quick uh, command here, which is npm inst npmg install TypeScript. All right, again, I'm expecting something quick here, but if not, um, yeah, let me add it real quick. All right, so so once you have all those three installed, all right, um, now we should be able to go back to our um, folder um, where we um, had our um, uh, code downloaded, right? Remember PancakeSwap, PancakeSwap Master, all right? And then what we're gonna wanna do, we're gonna wanna right click and click open uh, terminal here um then i'm gonna try good old yarn star because i believe that's what um what we had um uh last time ah but i forgot we have to do yarn install first right so you do yarn install it will install a ton oh god i remember this taking so long um i have um a, a P ptsd just um seeing this loading screen Christ. Um, hopefully, a lot of the packages are already installed and, um, it, and it will go quick. Fingers crossed. <laughs> Not really, though. Um, let me see if I can uh, give this some RAM, more RAM to work with. I'm going to close these out. So, um, also, I'll close this out. Maybe we'll actually let's just close. See if I can give this some more room to work with. Hopefully, we'll, it will be done sooner. Um, oh God! It's not moving. Kind of sad about that. <laughs> Let's see the damage and the, let's see the um the task manager like what type of damage is doing. Not much honestly, much better than last time. OBS is doing most of the damage here, um in terms of the uh, memory. All right. Um. Oh my RAM is okay. Need to upgrade, upgrade this um species of sure, but we load, we load um. Hey guys, while we are waiting on this, you know, we have to do it. We have to check out the yeah, all good uh, crypto um, prices. All right. You know, not that I don't already know where all the prices are. <laughs> Shut up, my boys don't buy it. All right. Um, yeah, so 41K um, Bitcoin, Ethereum 20, 24. Man, man, that's me. Really, everybody only cares about Bitcoin. All right. So ETF got approved. I would go to Twitter for the jokes, but I'm not sure who's funny these days on Twitter. Um, dude, we have to bring back this sailor, this sailor video, bro. Like sailor, Twitter, sailor, um, sell your house, mortgage, I don't know, Bitcoin. We have to find it, bro. It was like in the original video. We just, we got to find it, bro. You know? just like random clicking links here like uh, the, 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 the fact that it found it so quickly shows you like what a quality quality um, meme this is guys okay all right so this finished stage one of like installing a ton of shit Tr trust me guys you're gonna want this entertainment right now this is good this thing is gonna take forever and i'm not editing this, editing these shits okay i'm sure you guys saw we we're doing like um like different edits on the channel i'm gonna bring back the different the editing and the different um angles and stuff like that and maybe with like different more um you know uh easier to follow videos um than this one and we just brought back this for the uh the namesake all right but maybe we'll do the next one in uh 10 p and the better quality guys better quality but a little further ado boys your trolls all right which one's the best crypto asset well which one all right, guys, so if you've ever wondered, like, what is the next best crypto coin besides Bitcoin? This guy has the answer, guys. Okay, this guy is Michael Saylor. He is pro his company is probably the biggest holder outside of, of uh, traditional banking um, and, um, you know, exchanges of uh, Bitcoin. Right. And so he's uh, obviously uh, you know, a believer. 
right? And he has some advice for you. So I want you to take this in from the master himself. Which one's the best crypto asset? Which one's the best crypto asset? Well, Bitcoin's the best crypto asset. Okay. What's the second best? There is no second best. There's no second best crypto asset. There's a crypto asset. It's called Bitcoin, right? Right? There is no second best, okay? But take all your money, buy Bitcoin, then take all your time, figure out how to borrow more money to buy more Bitcoin, then take all your time and figure out what you can sell to buy Bitcoin. And if you absolutely love the thing that you're that you don't want to sell it, go mortgage your house and buy Bitcoin with it. And if you've got a business that you love because your family works for the business that's in your family for 37 years and you can't bear to sell it, mortgage it, finance it and convert the proceeds into the hardest money on earth, which is Bitcoin. Oh my fucking God, bro. <laughs> oh no, bro, this guy is so fucking like, that is so weird, bro. Like, but to give him credit though, like, Mans is literally taking his own advice. He literally like took every dollar from his own opinion and he's buying Bitcoin. So, hard to eat on somebody when you're, you know, like, um, you know, he, at least he drinks his own Kool-Aid, you know, which is, um, hard to say for a lot of um other guru types you know what i mean we, you know you guys you know we we drink our own kool-aid here you know like every time we like run into a bug you guys see me annoyed as fuck okay every time we are um i was trying to keep this video pg-13 but you guys know it's not possible with me um you know um field to contact turbo Continuing in standalone mode, connect to Turbo Daemon process field. Please ensure the following the process identified by the PID of the file. Blah blah blah. You can also run without the daemon process by bypassing no daemon warning. You cannot find the git folder. Um, f uh, falling back to manual file hashing, which may be stored if you are running this build in proven directory. You can ignore this message, otherwise, please initialize a git repository in the root of your um folder so basically this thing what this thing what would have preferred us to um you know um uh you know in uh have the git stuff basically but we're not doing that right now because we don't care about that right now all right but maybe in the future all right uh, maybe i'll show you guys the second one all right so once this is all done um let's let's see the back pancakes up here you get get you youtube boys attention all right i know who y'all skipping motherfuckers think all right um yeah all right so once you have um all those files uh installed you've installed your npm you've installed your typescript um you've installed your yarn all right and you have downloaded and installed all the dependencies again with uh, yarn install next thing you're going to want to do is yarn start and this should if we're lucky fingers crossed all right um start a pancake sub front end right now see this is running on pancake subs own servers our objective is to get our own copy our own uh, copy and code that we can run for ourselves that we can make changes to and then we can host on our own servers all right which again will be showing in uh will be showing and so um you know if you like these videos guys leave a like leave a comment if you don't have time for all that shit though you know email down below reach out to me me and my team will get it taken care of for you but um, yeah, we're here for the the headaches, guys. All right, if I am correct about this, they should be starting some stuff, and we field, you know. Um, let's see what it's uh, complaining about. Mm, could not find a production build of the following. Next. Ah, do 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 do. Guys, so this is what we weren't lucky. All right, um, could not find production build in the folder. Um, so it's looking for a next try building your app with next build before starting the production server. Um, mm, let's try that next build. Uh, npm next build. I love this to work. It wants us to install like next. I was hoping to get a, a very simple um uh one and done for you guys. Um mm, mm, 
okay i know what we do we hit I have ideas but just because i want to make sure i am giving you guys the actual um uh, uh process you know um, So once you have all those downloads, let's follow here. My, I kind of have an idea, like you can probably just do it a different way, but um, let me just set up these instructions, guys, um, just in case, um, you know, um, you know, um, I'd be fucking up um, for you guys. Again, we kind of took it for granted that that previous stuff would work, which if you were in the previous uh, stuff, you would have also maybe taken for granted. But let's install some stuff because obviously we gotta install some stuff so Kicks up, bro. Always like you know, getting us to install like new stuff for added one packaging before. All right, um, hmm. so stuff change, guys. Um, kill me, you know but we play along all right so you guys saw what i did here i just went uh, to the site here um downloaded something called pnp i'm pretty sure i've used this before um it's uh or maybe it's another one anyway it doesn't matter you know right click copy paste in terminal um we see it doing some stuff here god i hope this doesn't like take fucking forever bro. Yeah, and this complain about like this git folder um we could have done another way to like have this git folder and i'm kind of like suspicious if this is causing us problems but i am forever the optimist and say it can be done okay um let me hit this back uh p p n p n p n p m why do i feel like i know this package for p n p n p n p p p okay Let me let's try the first one. All right, and if um, everything went smoothly, then we should be we should have a. Uh, um, what is this? What did I see here? Okay. It says we wanted. I'm also gonna do build, you know, just because like, you know, you being. We, we did not play by the rules and we got burned so now we are being good um so again i am doing you know everything in order try it um yarn last time i think they switched um from yarn and blah 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 so now we do p e n p i know this thing it's uh i'm used to it as like a um What is this? Okay. 
Okay, let's try this again. Let's try this. Let's see what we got. That's weird. Alright, um, okay, 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 guys, we have to turn on our developer brains. Terrible. Alright, um, let's try again. God, don't you just hit it when you follow the money while and shit doesn't work? they moved it to a modular structure I, I was hoping Install dependencies. All right, you know what? I'm gonna behave, all right, and do install it with a uh, with a uh, GitHub. All right, so <sighs> fuck sake. All right, never mind this. All right, guys, we wanna do. We're gonna create a new folder. Call it Pancake. Gonna go there. Gonna open up a terminal. Right, just because I don't want it complaining about anything at all and also we should have done with the the fucking master branch bro like why do I like getting myself burned? Uh, mm. Yeah I, I want to check out the developer the branch, but it's at this point in time, it's going to cost me more headache than it's worth. And that's probably the, the reason why we're getting the headache now, because we didn't do it uh, with the master branch. So I'm going to go ahead and download the master branch and like try and like try to run the shit back. All right. Just for the sake of, you know, no headache. But I know um, you guys will also run into uh, these issues. Um, as a lot of you guys did in the previous list, so not bad. Oh god, we have to deal with this shit again. <laughs> and with all that, I still didn't take the time to like install it with GitHub. All right, you know what? Let me let me do it like with a T. All right, guys. So again, create the folder. All right. Um, Alright guys, we're gonna download like one more thing just because we're gonna do um, I'm just I already have this, I'm just showing you guys git uh download. Alright, um I'm actually gonna go through the whole thing again. So Windows, obviously if you're on something different, you're using something different. Um you do that, but um I'm like fairly sure you could have we could have gotten away with um uh, just downloading the master and doing what we were doing um before um but hey we're already here might as well and this video is oh, way 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 too long but I don't know sometimes you guys like the longer stuff you know. Can 
kinda curious about this other stuff in the meantime. I'm not so curious, I'm willing to annoy myself, but goddamn. Guys, if I'm not giving any instructions, it means like, um, you know, don't follow me. Right now, we're just wait, we're waiting on GitHub to finish um, downloading. All right, I'm just poking around um, the develop uh, to see, you know, um, what these guys are on. Do I really? No. Fuck. But anyways, I just wanna see if we can. Oh god, not worth, not worth, not worth, not worth. Alright, I'm gonna. Um, again, guys, if I'm not um giving any um instructions, just if you don't follow me. I'm just checking stuff over right now. Oh god, not worth again. Kind of checking out the code. I need this here. Alrighty, alright, so um, go back here again, you know. Once we have uh, Git um, downloaded, I already had it, I'm just um, doing for you guys. Um, uh, let me show you the new options. Oh, oh no, I want everything. Alright, so, oh god. So I'd leave everything checked that um, isn't unchecked all right um but also you can uh, you know just look at my options and click um everything that i already have here clicked as well use none of all right it's fine click it aside you 
and here you can kind of just look at what I have clicked and click it. All right. Um, if it's not already clicked, most of these are just the default options, anyways. Uh, what was that one? So, again, you know, I kind of left default options or whatever was checked before. Um, the reason why we're doing this is because I heard I, I saw I compl uh, crying about Git and I just wanted to um to squash that um if I could even though I highly suppose maybe that's unique to the um to the develop uh, branch you know but we took that risk in the beginning and uh, now we pay for it you know but um I'll I'll show probably show both because I'm pretty sure I can get um the other one started too with enough um. You know, Evelyn poor. Okay, um, uh, you don't have to launch Git Bash, but yeah, you can all uh, uh, find it um, in the CMD. Like you can just type Git, and you have this Git CMD or whatever. All right, but um, I will show you guys how to do this with Control. So what we're gonna wanna do, um once we have um uh, did i cancel this oh no oh no no my good sir we did not all right um all right so i get this all confused now but where, where did i download this front end master Was I not downloading master? No, I wasn't downloading master. All right, so once we have our Git um, finished, all right, again, we're gonna wanna go back to the pancakes of GitHub. Uh, click pancakes of front end, all right. Um, we're gonna click master, don't follow me, don't break the rules. I'll show maybe develop um, um, if uh, we can, all right, and um, code you'll see a uh, thing here it says git cli you can just click copy here all right and you can go back to our folder that we created in the beginning called pancake all right you can hold shift right click see open git bash right and you should be able to paste that command here and ah okay <laughs> uh, brother um CLI is good CLI and get like like not the same. So fuck six. All right, so copy this um, this one here, the first one. All right, and you're gonna do git git clone. And then you want to paste that. Alright, this is kind of the same thing as like downloading it, but you know, it kind of copies the git um, information which it was crying about, I guess. It also gives us that. What the fuck? Okay, right, so while it's doing that, um, all right, guys. So this is the this is the the official how we're doing instructions now. So, um, we're doing we're using a git clone as opposed to download. You can still download. I'm gonna jump back to that just to see if I can like get it, um, to um, you know, um work because i like messing with it but um yeah we're waiting for this and this is where we're at so you know when you see this come back on screen you guys can come back all right i go back to our previous uh field attempt all right i think i created a new one here which doesn't have um this all this stuff perfect no i um so i'm messing with both at the same time guys you get a two for one video okay I am not allowed to mix the 
these two op so pancake and pancake seven seven is the test the experiment the developer the develop branch i think oh no i know all right and um guys if i'm not talking it means you probably shouldn't be doing this but you can see it so That means it's gonna have to download all this shit again. I should not have done this shit while this shit was happening. We detected multiple package managers in your repository. Please remove one of them. Uh, please, re please remove one of them. Wow, bro, what the fuck are you trying to say to me? Hmm. I'm not mistaken, this is the exact same thing, is it not good, sir? Does I hear a knock? Is it a knock? I didn't download the develop one. I cancelled that and I started the new one. So, ah, right, right. Wait, why didn't it start then? This is the. Shit. We probably shouldn't have been fucking around with that. No, it uh, looks like it started over. All right, let's just stay fucking focused. All right. God fucking damn it. All right, I'll try. Okay, all right, guys. What do you do? Oh, what do you do? I kind of like. You're going to want to install GitHub desktop. This is just another version of Git. I don't know why that shit's like failing. Nothing is, is going our way today, guys. All right, once it's done downloading, you're going to have a thing like this. Um, all right. Oof. all right and you are going to want to um uh, go in repository all right um go to url all right uh you're right right and you're gonna want to paste this uh you again remember we're doing master here because we're not about this bullshit all right uh, master you're gonna want to get the url which you can get like this all right, um, paste it here. No, 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 we don't want it there. We want it at desktop. Um, let's call it cake. Cake folder, clone. All right, and hopefully this has some better um, error handling than what uh, uh, we had uh, here. I don't know why. Maybe my Wi Fi is shitty and it just doesn't have the proper error handling to deal with it. Alright, and then it's like not used to, you know, package 30 is huge. 
All right. So um, once you're done downloading um, GitHub desktop, maybe you have to also you know uh, have a GitHub account. If you have, don't have a GitHub account, just sign up for GitHub. Right. Um, you know, GitHub sign up. Right. Um, so many like we, we really we shouldn't needing to be taking this many steps. I'm sorry, guys. I'm just showing you like as I'm doing it, like what stuff's working and whatnot. So if you know like you run into all these like issues like I do, then you can just take the steps that I take. The longest part one ever historically or part ones have been um you know 20 plus minutes but on the flip side i also think the pancake shop um development build has gotten you know uh, better i think i remember um so hopefully that works you can see there my internet is kind of dropping a little bit which probably tells me that was the reason um you know uh, everything was failing god knows why you know, internet shitty, but it is as it is right now. Um, so you finish it soon. You can see um, it's uh, where it's downloading stuff here. Right, and there's that God forsaken git folder, you know, it was bitching about. Just making sure I like add that in here just in case I know like um, in the future with um, other things they might want to complain about that and you know why avoid a um, why not avoid a possible headache if we can <laughs> saves me and then I go and get the um, the develop branch. Actually, I'm, pr I'm pretty sure um, what happened was that I, um, no, those instructions were garbage. P P B. this is master branch. I'm pretty sure like I downloaded um, and I got confused when it didn't work. Um, so, uh, I switch back. Um, and uh, here I'm going to go and start. All right. Pretty sure if I like go back to our original folder, actually. By this time, I'm like committed doing it uh, this doing this other way as well. But I'm just testing. Shit's taking way too long. Um, I go back to our original guy. I do yarn dev. We work. We tried this before. So kind of just to give the audio and like what I'm doing here, I just went into the apps um, folder into the web, did yarn install. I'm gonna do yarn um, uh, start. No, I probably did it in the. Oh, oh I thought I was already probably doing it. Try yarn build. Trying to 
by next. Hmm. But I shouldn't have to install next manually. Um, I think I um, remember, guys. Where were we? Pay no attention to the typing on screen for this tutorial. We're waiting on this, guys. Okay. Um, This should have been installed manually um, or automatically with your building. Let me just try it anyways. Um, So this here is done, all right. So we, we leave our experiment for now. Um, we go back here um, and we made sure we were good this time, I believe. We made sure we got the, uh, the master branch, right? All right, and we um, make sure we got it good. So you now we wanna do, um, this real quick okay. yarn, open terminal I am being good thing wants me to um to enable something my only problem with that i um it's complaining about something on my yarn version so if you install yarn fresh maybe you don't have this issue if you did maybe you do so i think i have to do this in powershell the only problem is my Keyboard is at pitch and it is being problematic. Oh, oh. What am I trying to do here? Um, I just should have run it as administrator. So. So um, power show, I'm going to right click, run as administrator. All right, and I'm going to navigate to desktop. Stop this, stop this, stop this. Oh, for fuck's sakes. Okay. As administrator. I hope, dude, for, for lo I hope it's just my unique situation, right? And like, I just have all my 
um, stuff outdated and for like Christ's sakes you guys do not have to put up with this shit but if you do you know reach out to my agent because you know we put up with all the bullshit for you again email down in the description guys yeah. never these videos never feel to like shill, shill for themselves um, in your, um, I'm using on screen keyboard because my like thing is uh, fucked my enter thing Fuck six, man. Not what I wanted to do. Cancel. Um, this thing is complaining about something, something core pack. Um, dude, there's so many like fields in like terminals right now. I just don't even. Um, I think it was just core pack enable. Okay, I'm gonna take it that that worked. All right, um, do this. Enter. See. Enter. Enter yarn. Enter. the same version did I reinstall a yarn or no this can't hurt It possible that in, in the oh, it's in the develop branch, bro. Like, oh my god! All right, all right. So once you're done, um, downloading. <laughs> I'm just gonna like pretend like this. Uh, once you're done downloading it from GitHub here, um, I didn't even notice it was in the develop uh, branch. So you see these these branch the shits here can like cause you a lot of issues, guys. So make sure you're on the like right branch or you download the right one. All right, um, okay, no, we do. do you see how shook, do you, do you see how shook, I, I, I'm so shook, I'm looking at the instructions, boy, and I already know them, god damn it, yarn, all right, this time we work. This time, um, hopefully, it doesn't take forever. Um, so again, guys, to give a quick recap of like everything we did, we installed it. We we 
to give a quick recap, recap of everything we did and installed so far to get to this point we installed npm um we installed um yarn um i'll try and leave all the, the links to these things down below um we we, we installed node.js we installed yarn um we installed git and we we installed like github honestly just install github by desktop that alone should be enough right then from github desktop we got the um the pancake swap link i thought it would immediately just get the right one um once uh, i copied the link here and i master but um you click um uh new repository or uh, not new repository uh clone repository put url pop it in there Make sure you choose a folder that you recognize right and then from there you're gonna want to make sure you're on the master branch god damn it now i'm kind of determined to like figure out this develop branch because we've spent so much time here it's like ridiculous all right but um yeah dev life hmm. now hopefully it works um without too much bisha okay um we were very 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 optimistic about the time we'd be able to clock on this first video but you know historically we've been uh, at like less than uh, 20 plus minutes what's wrong with a little bit you know of a of a one hour video nothing wrong with that you guys get to see me go through it in real time maybe you face some of these issues maybe you can figure it out from watching me my own pain uh maybe not if you're tired of your own pain i can links in the description you can work with my web3 agency um you know um have my team go through the pain for you um recommended option you know but um yeah hopefully um it's not giving you guys too much trouble Okay, so it's building. Fail to connect to Turbo. Continue in standalone mode. Connection to Turbo DMR process field. Please ensure blah blah blah. So I'm guessing there is something called Turbo. I don't know if that's on um, uh, Linux or if that's a thing. Um, Windows. And in either case, it says we should be able to do it. All right. Now we have um, it's a success. So we are you know happy about it all right um did you see <laughs> did you see how shook i did like we usually don't read instructions from here but here we are let me let me try out this real quick they are in dev fingers crossed boys should work now i think but we have no idea where we like fucked up um you know in the beginning probably some mix up with the ver with the build and the versions and it's, it's this and that and it's not pain on the ass and it's pain when i found but um yeah so we uh make way shout out pancakes probably like boy in their defense you know they like um, I think they've significantly simplified the whole thing since I um, was doing it last, I believe, you know. All right, so once you um, have that here, I'm going to hit Yarn Dev, all right? Yarn Dev should get me um, a version of this I can start in my browser. If I go to the address, it tells me to go to in the terminal, all right? Um, which should be again you know again let me let me let me let me hit the audio preview motherfuckers all right so once you have that all downloaded whether you do it the folder method or you do it the um the uh git uh github uh method like i i just did all right um for all the the, the shit that wasn't working all right once you um <laughs> you, you do your um your install then you you do your yarn dev it should you know give you a thing like this where it says server started on uh, 3000 and then you should be able to type this url or click it i believe you can also click it 
uh, and it opens up in your browser i'm waiting for it here and it should render it can uh, can render faster i think this is because it's development mode but yeah look guys what we had what we should have had half an hour ago more than a, let me let's check this oh god what we should have had an hour ago um we have or um you know um we have our own version of pan le pancake early running okay and we will demonstrate this all right um by uh i don't know what's uh what's a good way let's change the moon is made of uh, pancakes right mood is made of you boys know what's coming pixels let's demonstrate by changing this all right um oh god bring me back bring me back all right um the reason why it's so slow is because it's in dev mode um i'm gonna take it out of dev mode but let me um dev mode just allows you to change stuff in real time i believe but let me change this stuff first and um show you boys so that we can make progress open with if you guys see my editor here this is uh adam or this adam new version of adam that's disconnected it's called pulsar adam adam was disconnected but i liked adam i didn't see any problems with it i didn't know why it was disconnected it seemed perfectly fine to me so i um just downloaded a community version um which should work just as fine but you can do this feel free to do this in your own editor all right so um Oh, we should be apps web source components all right and i want to know what component this is um or it should just be on the views page maybe yeah but i don't want to take that for granted um views maybe home index Pancakes. Very simple, is it? Um, I want to know what, what um, component this is. That uh, component this is. Uh, I have something called uh, React components, or I did have something called React components. Oh no, it's still there. I have a plugin called React components. Um, which you can download um, and you should be able to see if you um, go like so mm. what the heck is it? home hero All right, in what my happy next page home here Moon is made of pancakes. All right, so the moon is made of pixels, and you guys know where this is going. Spoiler um, for um, the next episode. All right, um, and the moon is made of pixels. All right, dope boys, dope, 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 dope. All right, uh, maybe we change. every time you refresh this is all right it's it's gotten faster for sure all right um and you can like obviously you know the uh, chase off all right so um <laughs> yeah this was a very 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 long um episode one all right to get the code um up and running um which we will be able to transfer over to our servers but before that we will be changing up um logos words stuff like this 
uh, and in general we'll be picking around but this video is already way 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 too long guys but but this was a point when if you guys do like these sorts of videos long or not long do you want it long do you want it short you know let me know down in the comments uh, down below all right um if you do and if you do want something like this reach out to me at the links down below email works perfectly fine uh at my web3 agency and we will get um this or uh, any other web three project uh done for you again shout out the pancake swap guys they do an incredible job maintaining this leave a like leave a comment guys and i will see you in the next one where we will be okay um making live our pixel swap all right guys we will be changing our our, our logos and i'm um, kind of giving you guys a brief introduction to that changing your logos kind of setting uh setting it up and of course um eventually like moving on to server so we can make it live so maybe you guys can finally buy some pixels which we've been promised to uh to, to launch the community since the beginning of time all right so um but this has been this video guys um leave a like leave a comment um uh, links down below all right and i will see you in the next one